Okay. Attempt number two. This time I'm ready for the teleporting. I just need to figure out how to dodge it. Son of a bitch! I'm Rick, welcome to another part of the certified being game blind playthrough of Dark Souls 3. I have a feeling I'm nearing the end. Um, as a result, I've done a bit of backtracking to here because again, apparently, there's a little door down here which I've remembered for a while. Ah! I forgot about these guys, it's been ages since I've been here. Uh, I remember there's a guy down here. Hello! OP. Uh, yes, this door. Apparently I've been given the key to open it. Well, holy crap. Huh. I... you didn't. I could have sworn that was locked last time I tried it. So I used it with the lift key and that was... Uh, where did I get that? Lift chamber key. A surviving dark wraith from the land swat. Oh, that's uh, what's his name? Ringfinger. He gave me that. The same guy that gave me the first uh, cracked red eye orbs. That's it. And this is yes. I remember now. Yeah, I've got blood on my uh, my my hood, and my helmet. This is a dungeon, and uh, okay. Well, this has all the makings of him being a badass. Is he the only one here? I think, yes. Look at all these soldiers. All these beheaded soldiers surrounded by nightshade. It's creepy. And lots of people have died fighting him. I'm, uh... Slightly apprehensive. Uh, let's have a go. Hey, Fudge Knuckle. Ha! Well. Don't, uh... Don't be afraid if you're plus level 100 when you come down here. Alright, that's done. Cool. Cool story. Thanks for the red eye orb. Let's have a look at that, shall we? Apparently it allows me to invade an infinite number of times. Invade other worlds at will. Defeat the host of embers. Yeah, the red eye orb is rooted in a tiny land swallowed by darkness long ago. Some chose to put the orb to other uses. To embark on this path, enter the service of Rosaria in the Cathedral of the Deep. Oh, yeah. Convenient. I am already in the service of Rosaria at the Cathedral of the Deep. I've been looking a lot into Rosaria's history and lore. Maybe I'll put together a video for it. Uh, but it's quite interesting how... She seems to be related in some way to the Dancer of the Boreal Valley. She seems to be related to the old gods, uh, Guinevere. That one's fairly well known by this stage. Um, but it's, yeah, it's, it's rather interesting stuff. And plunging into the lore and looking into it, it becomes very difficult to actually see... Well, to keep things separate. So yeah, looking into his area, you can't look into her and her history without examining the history of Aldrich of the Deep. And you can't look into his history without examining that of Pontiff Sullivan. And the fact that the Deep bears a lot of similarities to the Abyss, leading me to believe it's actually the same thing. Um, and that this age of the deep sea that Aldrich believed was coming was actually just the age of dark, but uh, a different interpretation of it. It's, yeah, it's a, there's a lot of stuff. And like I say, you look at one aspect of it and you end up having to look at the, like, the entirety of the game, pretty much. I still need to find out what's causing these stutters. It's only since we've upgraded to the 
patch 1.041. And I've been getting these little freezes every now and then. And I get them when I'm not recording either, so it's not a processor issue. Right, so I've come here. Yes, bravo. There, get off me. Right, dealt with. Also, these things, these appear to be transformed humans, because if you try and persist Rosaria to transform you too many times, you get warned you'll be turned into a man grub. Which is most definitely how I would describe these things as man grubs considering they are quite obviously well they were people and I believe that the one that was standing here holding his staff just leaning on it who didn't at hostile or attack I think this was Saint Clint the archdeacon who stayed behind to watch over Rosaria when Aldrich left and I think it's him because he's the one that holds the the invasion soapstone and as an invasion cult or, you know, well, let's face it, it's a cult. As an invasion cult, it makes sense that one of the higher figures of it would have the means to provide others to invade. It's a shame I killed him. I guess I'll never know. Okay, so I was expecting something to continue from being back here after picking up the red cracked eye orb. But I'm already part of it, so... I don't have any pale tongues with me. I've been a bit lax in my harvesting duties. Let's go back to the Phylinx Shrine. Maybe Ring Finger's turned up again. I know last time I said I'd be going up to that Grand Cathedral and going inside. Getting into fisticuffs with whatever beast he lies within. Presumably Lothric himself. Um, ooh. Presumably Prince Lothric's in there, so we will be doing that. I just... Ah! Wanted to have a look at this first. Aha, you found a proper red eye. I did, better than pink eye. Brilliant. I knew you were no ordinary man. Wait! Now invade and pillage all you like. Will do. And if you grow weary of your duty, you too may become a finger. Come on, give yourself to Rosaria of the Cathedral of the Deep. <laughs> I already did. I feel like I'm a bit behind on this guy's quest line. Now in vain and come on. <laughs> or rather, I've pulled ahead in the game because that was all achievable before the. Uh, before we even reach the Cathedral of the Deep. So, okay, let's head back there then. To Rosaria's bedchamber. It's really not as a provocative place as it sounds. Okay, here we go. There he is. He got here quickly. So, you've chosen to serve Rosaria after all? I have. She will be pleased with me for finding her another finger. <laughs> but be warned, my friend. Rosaria's fingers need only fetch tongues for their mistress. Otherwise, we are free. Unchained. Like Yellowfinger, you can choose to believe that all fingers share camaraderie. But do not force your romance upon the rest of us. <laughs> Okay. Rosaria's finger. Otherwise, you are free to do not force your room. <laughs> well then. Good to know. I forgot who Yellowfinger was. Do I have any pale tongues? 
I don't. I should really get on that. I need to start being naughty and invading other people. Oh well, we'll leave that there for now. Let's keep up as promised and teleport to... Is it the Dragon Slayer armour? It's the closest point I can think of. Okay, back this way. tend to be doing a mix of PvP and uh, PvE. Hey, got it right. Uh, yeah, I tend to be doing a mixture of PvP and PvE. Mostly because I'm not amazing at PvP, I'll be honest. I'm not very good at it. I, It's starting to shift towards the ratio where I die more than I actually win. Um, and as a result, the only way for me to farm embers is actually to help others rather than pillage them. Which I suppose is good in the grand scheme of things. Okay. So we are here then. Don't have too many skulls. Uh, skulls? Souls. Only have one skull. Oh, this is a heavy door, by the way. And it was pressurised in here. That's weird. Let there be victory. This is definitely a boss fight, isn't it? Look at this situation. I was going to walk dramatically up those steps, but hello. Good luck. I can see someone over there. Damn it, where are my binoculars? There they are. I can't tell who that is. It's a person hunched over on a bed. I'm expecting to find Prince Lothric in here, but I can't tell even if that's a man or a woman. Okay, what do we have? Any bad stuff around the edges. No, it's a fairly fairly unique arena. Oh dear. Another dogged contender. Welcome, unkindled one. Purloiner of cinders. You don't have to fight, you could just come with me. Mind you, the mantle of Lord interests me none. Is this okay? The fire linking curse, the legacy of lords. Let it all fade into nothing. You've done quite enough. Now have your rest. I'm guessing you would like to keep your head. Oh, shit! Oh, you son of a bitch, you can teleport. That is. Uh oh. Oh, God. Ah, uh, no. God damn it. Damn it. Ah. Uh. But you may rest here, too, if you like. Okay, teleporting. I really did not expect teleporting. Ah. Okay. Attempt number two. This time I'm ready for the teleporting. I just need to figure out how to dodge it. Son of a bitch! Ah! Uh oh. Ah! Fuck's sake! Stop it! Ah! Not ready. Uh, are you going to teleport? Or are you going to... God damn it, I knew it! <laughs> I dodged it! I dodged it! Ow! Failed. Oh my god! Damn it! 
Ow. Right. Way. Oh, too many hits. Got greedy. Guard up. I might just have to guard them. Oh. Oh, no. Drink, drink. Uh oh. Way. Okay. Lorian? They're not Lombric. I just noticed. Ah! Uh oh. Okay. Drink, drink. Ow. Whoa! Lagging at a bad time there. Damn it! One more hit. I oh, got him. But you're not the one I'm after. I am after that guy. Is this going to be a two-stage oh, boss fight? Dear brother, I'm on my way. Raise, please. My brother. Unyielding sword of Lothric's prince. Stab him now. Why am I just standing there? Rise if you would. Stab him now. For that is our curse. Piggy back. He's ended up. Of course he has. Drink. Oh, I've got to fight them both. Oh, he got fireworks! Okay. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Whoa! Ow. Okay, I can do a lot of damage to him. Alright, three hits now, not two. Ow! Oh, fuck's sake, I didn't expect that. I need to find a good time to heal. One, two, now. Damn it! No! One. I can hear him. Ah! <sighs> but you may rest here too, if you like. Now I'm. Just a hunch, but I think if I... I reckon if I kill Lorien again, Lothric is merely going to heal him. Like, during that fight, I noticed there were two health bars. And I could only damage Lothric if I hit him from behind. Let's throw ourselves at him again and see what we get. Oh god damn this lift. Why are there feathers in my room? God damn you! Ow! Cheat! Stop operating outside of the X and Y axis. Oh no, get back. Ah! Oh god damn it, this is not my fight already. Oh my god. Ah I've lost the rhythm. Scott. 
afraid. But you may rest here too, if you like. Okay. Got him. Does the dialogue change? Res, please. Oh, dear brother. You fucked up again. I'm on my way. I work. Oh, I hate this move. Right. Okay. One. Ah, oh, man. I hope this protects me. It does! Good to know. Ah, did not expect. Why has he gone over there? <laughs> Do your thing. What? But you may rest. Oh, that saved me the other two times. Okay, so, I have switched out my helm and my shield for stuff that's more resistant to fire. And I'm trying the claymore that I picked up that has a lot of different elements on it. So presumably we'll be able to see if he has a bit of a weakness here. Oh, end it. But you may rest here too, if you like. Okay, not this sword. And back in we go. Hello, Lorian, you knob. Oh my word! But you may rest here too, if you like. Hello, me again, you're an ass. Got him. Oh no! Wait, is that you? I, oh. So much happened there. Did it use the ember? I didn't get the health. I died. And it used the fucking ember! I used the ember, I died, I didn't get the health, nothing happened, I didn't heal. <sighs> Sup? So I switched out to a quicker weapon because I keep getting caught out. We're basically trading hits at points, and that's just not good. I need to avoid getting hit full stop.
for her out there. Okay, okay, I see what we're doing now. your bonfire. Oh. Thanks for watching guys. I'll catch you next time.